Hey guys, welcome to another BMS video. This is this is a FAM 105. It's the uh, uh, instrument practice flight over to Japan, Kadena. Hope you guys enjoy. All right, so there's Kevin taxing, and we're going to do a short flight in IMC conditions. ILS approach over to. So you're Kadena. just going to taxi burner? Yeah, I'm just kind of guiding him a little bit here. Okay. Just call tower then, whenever you're set. Yeah, roger that. I'll call holding short. Kimmy tower, one heads four two. On hold short, one may one six. Hold heads four two, Kim Hay tower. Left turn approved, wind one eight zero at nine. Runway one six, clear for takeoff. One F four two. One May 1-6. Alright, there's Kevin. So it's about a 20 minute flight uh, from Kimhei over to Kadena in Japan. And the uh, the weather, maybe there's like a 500 foot ceiling, maybe lower than that, 300 foot. Uh, kind of nasty weather getting into Kadena. There's a good amount of turbulence. Uh, so it's not, the, it's not the greatest approach. Up high, uh, above the uh, cloud layer. It's pretty uh, smooth up there, nice clear night. But uh, once we get into the ILS approach section, it's it's kind of nasty. You guys will see that in the video. So. Should I go ahead and take off first? Yeah, you're clear for takeoff, man. Go for it. Use afterburn. Nice. No, it needs to be four burner. <laughs> Oh, that's pretty. That was beautiful, Kevin. Alright, here we go. Kim A Tower, Hornet 4 1, holding short runway 1 6, ready for takeoff. Hornet 4 1, Kim A Tower, left turn approved. Wind 180 at 10, runway 1 6, clear for takeoff. If we take off runway 1 6 for corner 4 1. And you can hear Odie Kent's practicing his ATC skills. If, if you guys didn't know, Odie is a real life uh, controller graduate and um, he's just practicing some of his skills on uh, BMS right now, which is really awesome to have. Alright, forward, back, left, right. Alright, here we go. You guys can see how nice this weather is. Just bust it up over the cloud layer and looking at stars now. If you guys can see that on the video. Three airborne. Point four one, climb and maintain flight level two zero zero. Contact Odkin Center. Two three four point three. Two three four point three will uh Odekin Center and we'll climb up to flight level two zero. Thank you. Odekin Center, Hornet 4-1 passing through 11,000 with you. Hornet 4-1, Odekin Center, cleared to Kadena Airport via Proceed Direct Toyota, resume on navigation. Come and maintain flight level 200, report reaching flight level 200. Okay, we'll report uh, flight level 200 direct to Toyota, Hornet 4-1. Audicon Center, Hornet 4-1, establish flight level 2-0. Hornet 4-1, Roger. Alright. So we're at Angels 20, and we'll try to keep about 400 knots. I got the data link on here. There's Kevin a little bit ahead of me. Hey Kevin, you say Hornet 4-2, Buddy Spike, and then Bullseye. 
I haven't talked to you about Bullseye yet, though. But... Yeah, I'm just keeping track of you, bro. You're doing fine. Make sure you speed that 400. Altimeter 2925, descent and maintain. Uh, what was the altitude again? 10,000. 10,000, Roger. That's runway 19er, approach Kadena. Left to 090, horn forward. Alright, so. Uh, Center is just getting me down to altitude and trying to get me on an intercept course for the. 141, report reaching 10,000. Report 10,000, Hornet 1. Hornet 41, descend to maintain 5,000. Hornet 41, uh, we'll descend to maintain 5,000, pass through 10,000 now. Altitude. Altitude. Hornet 41 established at uh, 5,000. Hornet 41, Roger. You, are you turning now? Negative. I'm still at zero. And oh, oh, you're the flight and back then. The AI is in front of you. I was thinking that was you the whole time. No, I think that's actually Kevin in front. Uh, if it is, and he's turning and going back to Kadena. I mean, Kim Hay. Yeah, I think there is a one F-18 in front of me, too. Is that second flight? Yeah, it could be, because they do a loop around uh, Kim Hay and then head back. Well, sorry about that, Burner. You should be at 10,000 around now, then. <laughs> oh, all right. You want me to climb back up? Uh, it's up to you. You can, you can stay there if you want. Yeah, Roger. I got that traffic in sight. Headed uh, headed westbound. No, I got reported. <laughs> a little twinkly light right there. One one traffic, twelve o'clock, one five miles, northwest bound, Hornet, altitude one seven thousand. Yeah, one four one. I believe I have the traffic in sight, crossing to my right. Hornet 4-1, I got the traffic in sight. Hornet 4-1, roger. Yeah, those are uh, four aircraft up there. In close formation. And runway 1-9-er. And Kevin, I actually can't see you, so you'll have to call them in-game to get vectors if you need it. Got it. Turn right, heading 1-1-0. Right to one one zero one four one. All right, so I got Tacan, and there's a runway. That little arrow there, and it's twenty eight miles. Speed to two five zero knots or less. Two five zero knots one four one. I just said that because you're below 10, so you should be, but uh, you can speed it up a little bit if you want. Yeah, I know. And, and, uh, well, this is not military airspace, but right. sometimes I'll get special clearances to break that 250. 141 request uh, 300 knots if possible. 141 maintain 300 knots. Affirmative 141. Send to maintain 1,800. Send to maintain 1,800, Hornet 41. So I'll try to keep 300 here. 1,400. Hopefully these needles will start moving. Alright, there we go. Localizer just came Hornet on. Hornet 41, turn right, heading 165. Right to 165.041. I just busted my altitude. Gotta climb back up here.
All right, there's 145 and climbing up to 1004. Correction, Hornet 41, turn heading, correction, fly heading 150. Fighting 150, Hornet 4. Alright, doing good here. NATO's coming alive. I think Glide Slope's coming alive here. Now 14 away now. Still at 300. Yep. Uh, changing to heading 195 on final, Hornet 4 2. Oh. Alright, so there's Kevin right there. On final, Hornet 4 2. Left to 120, uh, 250 knots or less. Turn right heading 170, maintain 1800 until established on the localizer cleared. ILS runway 19 or approach, good enough. Right to 180, uh, and altitude 1,800 feet, Hornet 41. Hornet 41, report established on the localizer. Hornet 41 will report established. Out of center, uh, Hornet 41, uh, you want me at 1,800 feet? Affirmative. Roger. A 1-9-er, Kadena. Right, uh, to 175, and we're cleared for the ILS, or so runway 19, I can do. Hornet 4-1, report established on the localizer. Hornet 4-1, will report established. It's tough for me. I don't actually have the outer marking or the <laughs> runway direction on the map, so I'm just kind of guessing when you're on an intercept course with runway 19. So if you need to, I think you need to go over to your left a little bit more. But yeah, I'm not I'm doing too that sure. Now. Okay. Yeah, I'm going over to the left now. I'm out uh, eight miles. I'm still waiting for the localizer. I can send a Hornet 4-1 established on the localizer. Hornet 4-1, roger. Contact Kadena Tower 225.5. Good day. 225.5, Kadena Tower, Hornet 4-1. Good day. Kadena Tower, uh, Hornet 4-1 on fire. Hornet 4-1, Kadena Tower. Winds 179 at 10. Runway 19 or clear to land. Clear to land, runway 19, Hornet 4-1. See if we can pop out through the clouds here. Run at four one runway in sight. Run at four one, Roger. It's bumpy right here. So this flight is meant to be challenging. And it's a lot. Yeah, Roger. There's a lot of turbulence. Hornet 401, turn right at Delta, remain my frequency. Right at Delta Hornet 401. We'll stay on. There's a, a ton of uh, turbulence right at the end there, and it's kind of scary. But this is getting us uh, prepared for carrier approaches in bad weather and just getting comfortable flying in in uh, pretty nasty uh, conditions. I can see. Looking for that taxiway to the right. And just call when you're clearly active.
Man, that's uh, pretty. Hornet 401, we're making the right at Foxtrot at the end. Hornet 401, Roger. Cross, runway 19er. Proceed to taxiway. Uh, Back cross. and proceed to ramp. Cross 19, proceed to the ramp, Hornet 401. Yeah, you're on taxiway east, uh, which is kind of weird. Roger. Looks like there's two Delta taxiways. There's like a north and south. No, they're right kind of next to each other. I don't know how accurate this is to real life, and it might be a totally different system than we use. Alright, hope you guys enjoy that flight. I'll see you next time.